<laughs> Scott Pilgrim vs. the World has been described as the first comic book movie that rocks. All right, the film pits 22-year-old jobless indie rocker Scott Pilgrim against a fleet of his dream girl's ex-boyfriends. Oh, my gosh. Mm. Jason Schwartzman plays one of those exes, the seventh and final of them all. Look up, yes. Jason, uh -huh. so we can see that beautiful yeah, there face. You are. Yes. And Hi, Anna, Ken Schwartzman. Anna Kendrick plays Scott's snarky younger sister. Welcome to you both. Thank, Thank you, you for so having much. us. This genre is kind of funky, isn't it? It's sort of comic bookish and kind of like a real movie. Describe it to folks who don't Well, know. Anna, no, I, no. I don't want to cut you off ever. <laughs> do, do, uh, no, I was just going to say it's actually been uh, frustrating but kind of a pleasure to know that it's impossible to describe to your friends and family. Mm -hmm. um, you know, I, I, it, that's a good problem to have because it actually is so unique. Mm -hmm. And, you know, people come out of the yeah. movie and they finally see what I was talking about. They're like, yeah, no, I, you can't just say it's like this movie so mixed with no this movie. there's no genre. Because right. there's it's no movie thing. that's been like this before. I've thought about this before. I've thought if, when this movie comes out on video, which is, um, that's, that's old-fashioned uh, term, I guess, yeah. DVD <laughs> now, but um, I feel like you'd find it in the comedy section, the action section, the romance section, the classics so, section. <laughs> so there's <laughs> something for everyone. I, I think there's something for everyone, and it really is. It's it, it's an old-fashioned kind of swashbuckling mm -hmm. adventure story where this guy, where this guy, yes, where this guy has to <laughs> fight uh, fight these seven ex-evil uh, boyfriends it's for really the love of his and, life. And you really had to train for these fight scenes, didn't you? This wasn't. I trained. Really? Yeah. How hard did you train? Um, I trained really hard. Yeah. I mean, I, I did a lot of, uh, the, all the ex-boyfriends did a lot of, um, wow, there I am fighting. Oh my gosh, look at me. Uh, I, we all did a lot of sit-ups, push-ups, um, medicine ball work, I overall yeah. overall conditioning training, and then each evil ex-boyfriend, they have a certain style in which they fight. My style is sword fighting, so I got to... You have to, to uh, take them all on. I got to, yes, and I got to learn how to fight with an actual sword. Mm -hmm. They're heavy. They're very heavy. Yes. They're yeah. very heavy, and it's and it's it's hard to fight Michael Sarah. He's so sweet yeah. and uh, incredible. And mm -hmm. even if you're faking it, it's it's you don't want to attack mm -hmm. him. He's wonderful. But you had a good time on this movie. I loved mm -hmm. it. And you had to just be snarky. Yeah, I had to just be snarky and <laughs> be a, a disapproving younger sister. I am playing myself. <laughs> I'm absolutely playing. I'm Come I'm, on. I'm being so lazy Come in this on. movie. Really? I just, this is, is the relationship that I have with my older brother. So uh -huh. I you just, just showed up. I just showed up. It was like breathing. This child showed up on Broadway. Yes. And was Tony nominated when she was 12 years old, already Academy nice. Award nominated for Up in the Air with George Clooney a couple of years ago. Who you have a crush on, right? Hey, I'm just take it easy. Uh, I'm done. Hey, hey we all do. Throwing me under the bus. You guys, you guys think he's handsome? Yeah. You know what? It's more than just handsome. There's just what it, is it's it? Like, his style. Explain it to me. What is it? Look I, I know. just look for one. Second. Oh my God. No, it's oh, his personality <laughs> too. He's funny. Looking at myself. He's funny and he's smart, and yeah. that's the sexiest Sexy. thing in yeah. the world. Yeah. Besides you and tights. Would you stop? <laughs> <laughs> ah. So who is this movie for you guys? Is it for young kids or is it for grown-ups or? I think it's for everybody. Yeah. I mean, honestly, I think young young people will love it because it is very modern. It has a lot of um, tech video game tech yeah. kind of stuff um, but I also think it's it's for adults it's for anybody my mic yeah. uh, thing just That's fell right. off yeah. but I don't care yeah. um, my uh, I, I, I think it's for adults too right. who just who want to see a great fun adventure mm -hmm. movie and I, I really think it's just about having fun this cool. movie and if you and it truly is very unique. There is nothing okay. like this movie. I've never seen anything like and it. And pound for pound, it's just like every shot, every line is so funny that it's like yes. you know, you 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 would have to be. You would have to be dead to not enjoy this movie. Okay. You'd have to well, not we'll have see a Cody has I to get say it. about you it. You want to see Free Love? I get it. <laughs> <laughs> you want to see The Expendables? I get it. You want to see uh, Inception? Whatever. Yeah. This movie. You gotta see. Thank you. You gotta see something beautiful and amazing. It's unique. Jason, and we Anna. believe Thank you. Thank you. Not you. Not to. Thanks so much. You guys are amazing. Thank you. I'm so honored to be here. Oh, he's so cute. He's got a little crush on you. What? Up next is a story that'll steal your heart.